Alrighty guys, welcome back to more Nino Kuni 2. We just finished up another side quest. Well, technically we just got the item to finish up the side quest, but since we are already here, I think we might as well just go ahead and do this dreamer's uh, door. We're gonna do this dreamer's maze really quick, and then we're gonna go hand in this quest that we just finished for the sea salt water, the, the pure sea water or whatever. Alright, here we go. Wow, 76 guilders. The chest coming up. No special features, the door's coming. Oh boy, these dudes are, uh... Oh, 1337, she did that leap damage. So, we actually have a lot of benefits going on for us right now. Um, we actually have, we developed a lot of stuff at the uh, Dimensional Lab, which essentially lets us do, get some, we get more orb, and we are able to like find and locate stuff a lot easier. So that door is right there, but what's up here I wonder? Definitely a chest. Watch your back. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Pop, pop, pop. Bonsai. What we got here? Nice, four leaf clover. Or four leaf sore away, I should say. She's smashing pots like this is uh, Zelda. Like, yo. Her attack is slow, but guess what? Guard cancel. Like, look how slow that is. But you just wanna do that. If you can, if you can do that, she becomes better. <laughs> like her attack being slow ain't gonna matter at that point. Like, if you know how to guard cancel, Bracken is actually pretty good. What's over here? I don't think we were over here, right? Oh, we were over here then. Oh wait, no, we weren't. Careful, everyone! Ooh, Evan just smoked that kid. Evan just smoked him. Holy moly! Nice. What we got? Watery ogre's bowl. Smash these pots open real quick. You feel me? Alright, danger level 2 is gonna definitely happen. Alright, go to the next floor. To the next floor! To the next floor! We gotta keep going up. That's not the end. Just because you see a door don't mean it's the end. It's the beginning of another floor, that is. Boom, danger level two. Now these dudes should be like 40 something. All right, I don't think we want to go to danger level five here. <laughs> That's gonna be a problem if, if that happens. Damn. Do try to go in. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hit him with that. Oh! I guarded it, but it still did damage. All right, here we come. Oh, you got throws? To hit him with the thumper. The door is behind us. Okay. Pot of thick yogurt. I'll give yourself thick, alright. Oh, some thick yogurt, right? You ready for this? Uh, uh. Boss in the cap. Uh 
look at this motherfucker. Yeah, you better run. Oh, what, you didn't run? Bad idea. Bad idea, essay. <laughs> we got ice prisms, clear prisms, blue prisms. Blue chest, yep, alright. I'm pretty sure we got enough uh, orbs to open that chest. Twenty-five orbs, huh? Oh, shiny champion's ring. Oh, that's a better champion's ring. Alright, and I think she has the regular one on. Shiny Champion's Ring. Let me get that equipped on your girl, Bracken. Strengthens all attacks. Alright, cool. Boom. DB. BD. Alright. What is this? Here, the dream door. Continue to the next floor. I can't wait to shoot more enemies. Bullets consume my enemies. <laughs> well, that's surprised you can hear me, can you? All right, cool. They say the same generic thing every time. They just give you something unique. Cool. Dollop of sour sap. I'll give you some sour sap, all right. <laughs> all right, looks like we're gonna probably be out. Yeah, hold that. Nice, bust a capping people. Bust caps. We'll have him after this. Damn. There we go. Look at that. Look how quick that was. Burning Hercules. Done. All right. This is the. Now we got. We get, we're a little bit dangerous right now being here because the base level of these enemies are like high. So like, if we get the danger level five, that's gonna be a problem for us. Ooh. Ferocious Starfall Sword. Look at that. We're getting some good stuff. The Dream Remains just give you some good stuff, man. Ferocious Starfall. Increases damage dealt. Huge damage boost at max MP. I kind of like that better, though. Yeah, because this one is better. Huge damage boost at max MP. And then the one we got increases damage dealt. And, yeah, the new one we just got is kind of trash. Well, it ain't trash, but... We already have something better. Here we go. Wait, is this something else? Let's continue to the next floor. Keep going. So Bracken is our leader right now. I'm gonna remain that. Oh, nice. No danger levels going up. So this must be the break for it. We get a break and then we keep going up. You know, these dreamer mazes aren't bad. Ooh, we got a cough sweep. Picking up items on the ground. The thing is, what makes them bad is if you die, my guy. <laughs> If you die, you you basically don't get to keep any of the things here. Damn, I should have kept my orbs. You probably would have got something really badass. Move to the next floor. Ba 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 ba. 
Alright, Tide Wash K. Hey, go, 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 Pig, pig, to the pig pit. To the pig pit. Oh my god, this dude almost 50. Good luck, everyone. Oh, he got destroyed anyway, man. I think their levels go up, but I don't think their stats go up too much. I mean, their stats obviously go up, but I don't know about how much. Profiteer's pendant. Uh oh. I think we get more items with that. All right. Do 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 do. All right, there's a, a lot of stuff over here. Profiteer's pendant, gloomy rowing sword. Hold on, we want to uh, see what that pendant does. We feel. Ability balls heal MP a little bit. Increases max HP by how much, I wonder. Slightly boost money drop by foes. See, that's not bad. HP, who really needs the HP? Tani does. Like, Tani has the least amount of HP. It goes up by 100. That is actually not a lot. <laughs> That is actually, hey, just deal with it. That's like, hey, I'd rather just deal with it and get something better on my accessory slot. All right, come on, Bracken. Dun -dun 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 -dun. That's all I'm on. Let's roll. All right, we gotta go up. Ah, ah. I try to dodge that. Ah, the camera got all funky. Never be close to a wall because the camera will go balls to the walls. With you. Whoa, he parried me. Good thing I had reactions to dodge that. Candy out. All right, screw everything else. Let's just go over here. Continue to the next floor. Inevitable. We're definitely going to four. Here goes nothing. Ooh, boy. Uh -huh. Nice level up, though. Uh -huh. Whack a mole. Playing whack a mole with these guys. Uh -huh. <laughs> Whack-a-mole, whack-a-mole, whack-a-mole. Strong six cents, huh? Five orbs, let's do it. Yeah, playing it safe. Never thought I would do that, but I am. All right, now we can probably go get some more orbs and stuff. Where we can, yeah, I think that's where we can. Let's go get some more orbs in preparation for this next uh, chest that's most likely gonna happen. We'll probably need around 30, at least 30. Okay, we need six more. Damn, 
find the next floor. There's another floor. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, all right, all right. We got more. I got more. Here goes nothing. Oh, oh not today. Uh, uh, uh. Now's your time to shine. Put him to sleep. Take him to sleep. All right, let's keep going. So we got a lot of orbs here, and there's no, there's no true infinite in this game, you know, because every enemy. They don't stagger, right? You just gotta react. You gotta react to uh, what what they do right after you get done hitting them a bunch. Which makes sense in a game like this. Who is this guy? He looks like he looks like one of those Trump supporters. Right. Now, don't you just love all the different kinds of materials there are in the world? All right. But for 10 orbs, that's half the fun. But for 10 orbs, I'll give you 10 of what I've got. All right. Oh, you see what he gives us. He better not take my stuff. Oh, 10 pieces of fine grain lumber. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. That color, the wonderful shape, they're just perfect, don't you think? Of course you do. Can I talk to him again? Right. All right that's not bad, I guess. But now I still need to get four more with the inevitable blue chest that we're gonna have. Alright, this is a group of enemies, I should be able to get them out. By a group of enemies, I mean one more enemy. You ready for this? Damn, smoke them. <laughs> Smoked. You know you did. <laughs> Violet Pastille. Oh, there's a pot right here, please. Damn, I need one more. No, don't do this to me. Alright, so this is the last door. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Alright, so blue chests in this, in this dungeon are open. You can open them by using, you know, orbs that you collect, the purple orbs. Blue chest on the world map, and then regular dungeons can be open if you have a spring lock spell. Which we, we, I was looking for blue chest to open, and all the ones we opened so far have been actually really useful. Uh, I'm actually looking for the chest. Either decrease our level for the upcoming boss fight, or the danger level, or save my orbs for a blue chest kind of boss. Aquatic? Alright, so we want to tactic tweaker the hell out of this. Wonder versus... Slimy. Yeah, jellyfish I would think would be considered slimy, right? Alright. I think we're looking good. Bracken is pretty much going to stay back and lame this dude out. Or I could just go with the tech with Roland. I don't know. We're going to try to lame him out. You know what? Let's eat some food first, I guess. Strength in his melee attack slightly improves. It's nothing that slight that uh, it strengthens ranged attacks. All right, let's give her that. We're going to give more likely to inflict status elements. Uh, yeah, let's use it before the fight, just in case. And Evan, 
Evan, you're gonna get some magic or some kind of like physical defense, my guy. We're also gonna go see if there's any better equipment we can equip for you. Cause I got I got a weird feeling about this guy. This guy is on a, he's gonna be on a higher base level. I think he's gonna be at least 50. At least 50. Dude looks like he's a water type, right? All right, let's get it. I mean, if he doesn't want to fight me, that's cool. Elite's archers ring. Okay. Good luck, everyone. Oh, the healing is still that well. Lay down the healing. Uh-huh. We got the healing laid down. And now I can kind of just spam shot. Boom. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We're still getting healed. That's crazy. Just go lay it down and just stay in it, right next to it. I'm backing up from this. I don't know what that. I don't know what that's doing. Uh, Y'all confused? Oh god! Roll inside of his base. Uh huh. Roll inside up in there. Up in his face. Cause he can't touch you if you're up in his face. But it's hilarious. Lay it down again. Like, <laughs> Bracket is kind of cheap. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Bracket is kind of cheap. Let me just lay down a healing field. Pa 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 all right, we got like 40. There's gotta be a, there's another chest around here. There's gotta be. It's gotta be. I think it was showing up on the map already. Oh yeah, there's no blue chest here. Damn, I collected all those pots for nothing. All right, that's fine. So if it's like a big guy like that, you just get next to him because he can't hit you. His hitbox is like pretty uh, hilarious. But some of the bosses are ridiculous like that centaur tainted monster. Like that dude, he can kill you in one hit. His, his mobility and he just stomps down on you. It's like, wow. Like... <laughs> Some of them dudes are kind of outrageous. All right, there might be another, no, I don't think there's another uh, reason to be in here. So what I can do though, exit to the world map, come in and go to the left and see if there's anything in there. I like Bracken because she shoots people like effectively. Like I'm talking like, yo, you in her way, you getting shot. <laughs> All right, let's just, I got the hiccup, so no. I don't think there's anything in here. All right, I was just double. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh no, I thought maybe there was gonna be something here. Okay. So we're just gonna leave. We got that dreamers fragment. That's good. I think we have like four dreamers fragment. We can probably do her quest. We can probably finish this quest for her right now by getting all the dreamers fragments and whatnot. But now I want to know what the heck is this? 
It's a cave like right above it. Death door. Whoa. I don't like the sound of death door. But we'll check it out. Cause we're explorers. Ooh. Night white thread. It's been a long time thinking about mortality and trying to imagine what will happen when I die. And now after I and now that I'm here, I'm spending my afterlife speaking to you. <laughs> it's safe to say that I wish I had done more with my life while I still had the chance. Damn. It's probably gonna be a splendid monster in here. Do, 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 do. These are 46, 45. So we're probably going to see a tainted monster down here. Ooh, cosmic peas. Sounds delicious. Man, look at this guy. Whoa, why is that a red motherfucker? That's like a straight boss. Holy shit. Um... He doesn't have tainted, but we've never encountered something like this. He's not even tainted. Huh. That's interesting. Fuck it. Watch your backs. Lay it down immediately. <laughs> Like a red ass. Put an ass in. Got a donkey kick me too. Wow. Got healed. That was interesting. That was different because the, the mark on which he showed up on the map showed him like he was a boss. Whatever. All right then, all righty then. Bracken just laid it down. Everybody else did work though. Lay down the tr the hill. Get the bills. Hey, look at this. We found the Higgledy stall. Higgle Piggle. It's talking about that broad the broadcade stuff. You know the stuff that makes you think of men in armor charging around the battlefield, huh? Footman's broadcast. Is this what he's talking about? You know what? Fuck you! Fuck you! I don't think I have it. Hold on, let me look at it. Still, so that makes you think of armor. I definitely don't have what they're looking for. I never have what they're looking for. It pisses me off. It's like, bro, just relax. Anyway, we need to go to Hydropolis. Turn in this damn sea idol. And recruit this chick. And we also need to go to Broadly because you know they got plenty of stuff for us there. They're gonna have plenty of stuff for us there. Higgle Piggle. All this backtracking I'm gonna have to do. Hey there. Wait, wh you. why am I here? Oh wait, yeah, the, the chick over here. Wait, what kind of items y'all sell? Hey there. Sour salts. Hmm. Nope, See you. I'm out. Yeah. Corporal Dion, huh? About to be found. Yeah, I got, I got it. You got the deep sea water. Hey! You handed over the jar of deep sea water. Thanks. Thank you. Now I will be able to complete my potion, and the mirror folk will be able to travel the world without fear of feeling unwell. Perfect. Thanks to you, I will have be able to mix up sizable quantity of a potion that I'm sure will work exactly as we need it. 
Thank you very much. I must offer you my gratitude once again. Thanks to your efforts, most the merfolk of Hydropolis are now freer than ever. Ha 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 ha. Oh, I was rather a sickly child. That's why I became a doctor. All right. How many games we played now that has had that same story? All right. Persona 5 was the first game I think I played with Tai Takimi, right? Takimi Medicines. She said she had the same story. She was the first one. And then we played East 8 with Lick. I was sickly as a child, so that's why I became a doctor. That was the second game. And this is the third game, Fetus, with the same story. With the same story. Hmm. Perhaps we should consider action theater to join us in our kingdom. All I've heard of your new nation, all the peoples of the world gathered here. You know, in other words, there may be more ailing individuals who require my aid. Mm. Oh. Wait, okay. Uh, wait. Oh, we got cauldron sense. Nice. We need her to develop better medicine. Thank God. Now that we have her, we can develop better stuff for medicines and whatnot. All right, sweet. So, last thing, next thing, next thing we want to do. Go to the dry lands and try looking for this one guy. We can try doing that. I'm pushing the wrong button, of course. Let's go to... Broad Leaf. Do, 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 do. Let's go to the entrance. The entrance. Common backstory for the doctors, I agree. And I was sickly, so I did. Oh my god, what is up with all these damn quests here? Oh my god, someone saved me. Is this a robot? Root not found, root not found. Are you okay there? I am a goddamn robot. Do I look like I'm okay? I have no soul, and I was programmed to serve humans. But I thought robots did get lost, they didn't, you know, have feelings. Misinformed opinion detected. I should roast your cat ears have an ass. Without them, the likelihood of my completing this delivery is 2%. Gosh. Maybe I should go to the delivery instead. Kind action detected. Yes, please. Thank you. This package must be delivered. Mm. All right, leave it to me. You obtain the package for Chip. Intelligent question detected. Yes, the package must be delivered to a researcher named Chip. It contains important materials for his experiments. Thanks. I'll see what I can do. Hey, we actually might be able to recruit him. Yup, Chip. Chip, 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 Chip and Dale. A deep scientific knowledge that can help boost work at the Dimensional Lab. Alright, cool. Uh, I guess. We're here for that. We also need to find candy. 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 Whoa, what the hell? Is anybody there? Can anyone hear me? This dude's name is Oz. Um, Are you alright? Uh, Man, finally, I haven't heard a human voice in so long. Please, you gotta get me out of here. What's going on? Who are you? What are you doing in there? My name is Oz, I'm a part of the Treehouse security team. I was just out on patrol when the system went down. Now I'm trapped in this room and the door won't open. I tried my best to force it. I tried everything I could think of, but nothing seems to work. Wow. I'm not surprised. This door is made of a special alloy. There's no way anybody can force it open. Oh. Tell me about it. That's why I started shouting for help. Mm. We're here now. We'll have y'all out of, you know, we probably got to use the spring lock. Spring lock, maybe? If the door still did uh, self shut when the system went down, all we need to do is bring the system back online. Oh, never mind. We gotta go reboot a computer in the factory research lab. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Mm. We just have to make sure we don't get spotted. Really? Please, I don't care how you do it, but you you gotta get me out of here. I'll give you anything you want in return. You better join my uh kingdom then. Yep. The ability to help withstand hardship that can help boost work at the training ground. Really? 
Shadow Salad. Alright, we got a lot of people to recruit here, huh? Damn, look at this kid. Snap back with the glasses. Ooh. Mom and dad are home in time to eat dinner for the first time since like forever. Kid with the snap back on. Kid with the glasses on. Yo! Hey, Ken, it's you, the guy who said brought leave ink. Say, I wonder if you can do me a huge favor. Oh! What is it? Um, uh, I won't buy your mixtape. Uh, uh, I'll, uh... <laughs> hey, hey, hey! What do you mean, you won't buy my mixtape? Why would you assume I had a mixtape? Because I'm black and I wear sunglasses? I guess I should introduce myself. The name's Kent. I'm Broadleaf's chief magical or analyst. Analyst. Mm -hmm. She's magical. Hmm. Magical or analyst. A scholar of a certain special type of rock. <laughs> the type of ore you find in given places is affected by a whole bunch of factors. The location of the mine, the weather, all that stuff. It's my job to crunch all that data. Hmm. And complex and then extreme, I imagine, yeah. <laughs> Kinda, I guess, anyway. I can't crunch any data right now because a memo lift, I stored all of it. It was stolen by a monster. Oh man, it must be terrible not to be able to do your work. It sure is, and that's why I need your help. I mean, you're a, f you're a fighting guy, right? Martial arts and stuff? You can beat that thing up and get my memo list back, no problem. I'm not actually to do it for nothing. I'll give you something pretty special in return. Yours truly. Um... Oh, you? <laughs> Once I get my memo list back, I'll head straight over to your kingdom and start doing my thing. Mm. I can't say no to an offer like that. Crawl Space Cave. Hey, we were just over there, which is hilarious. What the hell were you doing over there anyway? Prospect is I. Nice. He's gonna be good. Alright, let's go defeat Skyrich. Alright, that's one thing we can do today as well. Alright, let's go accept some more quests with another robot. Can we recruit a robot? Andrew the robot. Hey there, Ivan. Ivan per Periwinkle Tendrum. <laughs> Gosh. I don't think anyone's managed to get my name quite that wrong before. <laughs> mm. Are you okay, Andrew? Did you run a system check recently? Beep, beep, boop, bop. Hey there, cracking metals. <laughs> I've chunked my systems. <laughs> and I'm, <laughs> I'm happy to say they're toppity, tippity, tip, top, top, tip. What the? You're on the frets for sure, bro. Oh, not you too. I've had it when people call me a piece of junk. I had it. I didn't even call you that, Andy. It's clearly not okay, pal. Well, that may be, but it's not my fault. It's my components. They're way out of date. Once I get the latest chips set installed, I'll be good as new. I don't want no robots working for my kingdom. I don't want wow. no robots working for my kingdom. Whoa. <laughs> I heard those quintillion... Cord processors are pretty good. Damn. Where might we find these processors? You won't find them in any store. You know why? Because a bunch of blitzers, 2.0s, have stolen them all. Oh, those blitzers are tough. I bet it wasn't stealing exactly. You see, these things are programmed for self-improvement. My guess is they figured out that taking the stuff straight from the factory would be faster than waiting for their turn. Wow. Beep, beep, boop, bop. That's just about the size of it. And we can't let their algorithms learn that crime pays now, can we? Oh. All right, all right. We get it. We better hit the factory floor and find our friend where his proxy... Oh, man. Yeah, we can recruit... Some oh, technophilia. Yeah, talent that, that can help boost work at Institute of Innovation. We'll need him because he actually will help us get a very, very cool uh, passive ability for the kingdom. Upgrade for Andy. What, 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 what's with Andy? What, 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 what's with Andy? All right. All right. All, all right. Take it easy. All right. Evan Petty Whisker. Oh, look at this down. Look, oh, this, this cat buff. Oh. Unemployed gardener. That could really help. I know I could if only people knew about me. Is everything all right? Well, not exactly. I'm a gardener, you see. I'm from Ding Dong Dell originally. I can't probably to look for work. There's no place for me here. Everything's done with machines. I don't know what. One end of a circuit board from another. That's unfortunate. A 
course, I knew that probably would be full of technology. This is a kingdom of mechanically minded folks, actually. Why? And I don't have a problem with that. In fact, exact, it's exactly like him. I thought if some, if everyone else was busy with their gadgets and such, there'd be a need for someone like me who's in touch with the natural world. Thank you. I guess that makes sense. Planting the wrong types of trees all together, I'd be happy to give some advice. I need your help. Oh! I'd be happy to. Alright, before leaving, I'm not doing this. Hell no. Not yet. I don't give a. I don't mess with you. We got a bad egg. Alright, since we'll we did a couple of quests, Smith I want to see if he actually has, like, anybody new I can uh, trade off. Nope. Oh, by the way. By the what? There's this kid. Oh, wow. Upper downtown. Lower midtown. Upper midtown. Lower uptown. God damn. There's a lot of quests. All right. Let's just focus on getting enough done for now. Okay. My goodness, my guy. This is rough. All right. Let's come over here. We need to deliver his chips package. Um, am I going uptown? Midtown? I guess I'm going uptown. Oh, man. There's another guy over here. Or a girl. Yeah, look at all these unique people. Excuse me. Brianna, look, if you want to land a killer blow, you gotta get up and clo close and personal. What? Hey! Brooke, that's not what my data says. According to my research, you stand a much better chance if you keep your distance. Hmm. Crystal, maybe Crystal with a K. <laughs> maybe magic is the answer. That's not gonna be the best way of changing things up. What they gotta do, what they need help with. You might wanna take this someone someplace more private. I'm sure you don't want us listening in on all your military secrets. Military secrets, ha! <laughs> is that what you thought we were talking about? You got this totally wrong. We're just talking about how to get ahead in the workplace, that's all. Hmm. Let's see what that what does that mean? It's just, it really sounded like you guys were talking about fighting. I mean, I get why you thought <laughs> that, all that stuff about killing blows and everything. Sure, it might sound like we were talking about battlefield strategy, but that's because the, boy, the boardroom really can be a battlefield sometimes. You must have heard about all this stuff, right? Running in, all that, you know? What female employees? If the language gets a bit aggressive sometimes, sometimes, well, there you go. We're not going to get anywhere by being nice all the time. Gosh. You take your work very seriously, don't sure. you? Sure. We all know how important it is to have hobbies and interests outside the office. Really? What things are you interested in? Hmm. Yeah. One thing we all love more than anything else is weapons. <laughs> I'm a sucker for anything pointed. Piercing weapons, they're totally my thing. I'm more of a swords gal. The simpler, the more elegant the design, the better. Man, I can stare at swords all day. The magic maniac of the bunts. Wands, wands, wands. <laughs> hey! So, you travel a lot, right? I guess it's kind of rude to ask, but if you ever spot any cool souvenirs while you're out, we sure to... Yeah! We want to see them. Okay, they want to see the weapons we get. A little horn shell. Yeah, you can wear it in your hair. Sounds good to me. What? Little horn shells. We probably have to go kill some people for that. Damn, why is there so much, bro? Hmm. I just don't get it. Why won't these trees grow? Hey, are you having some troubles? Yeah, this is the. Okay, we found the. Ah, oh, okay. Alright. Hmm. Huh? I'm going crazy trying to figure things out. So yeah, so we gotta get the buff tiger to come up here. Dude, there's another quest. You know what? We're gonna save the game, take a break, accept some more quests, and hopefully we'll recruit enough people by the end of the next episode to raise our kingdom to level three, and we'll be able to advance the story after that. So I'll see you guys soon.